Hello and welcome to LearnPythonTutorial.com and today in chapter 4 we're going to talk about why are floating point calculations so inaccurate. They're not inaccurate but a lot of people believe they are and the reason behind this is because Python is built on top of the C language and the way the C language handles floating point numbers is by converting them to fractions and then when it kicks back the floating point number to us it has to convert it from a fraction to a floating point number so it can't be all that accurate it's off by a couple decimal points or the numbers are slightly off it's very close but it's just how it kicks it back to us um, so let's take a look at an example here if you, you haven't seen this yet we have one of our YouTube users viewers um, send us a comment about this and since we're starting numbers this week I wanted to get this out early rather than later in, the, in uh, our tutorials because if you're messing around trying out some calculations and you run into this issue I don't want you to you know be so confused with what's going on so let's take a look at this the, the viewer sent me this example so I'm going to use it 8.7 hit return and this answer should be 16.3 all right but what happens here is when we we add up 7.6 plus 8.7 we get these two numbers get sent in as fractions to the C language and or they get sent as floating point numbers and the C language converts them to fractions and then sends it back to us as floating point numbers but the conversion from fractions to floating point numbers isn't all that accurate and the reason why it does this is because there's only so much room for um, numbers within the memory of the C language it's either 32-bit or 64-bit so it has to convert it somehow and fractions is the easiest way so it creates it as fractions now if we run into this issue we have two ways to fix this or we, there's a couple ways to fix this. I shouldn't say just two. Um, there's a couple other, but in in this tutorial series, we're going to focus on round. We can round this number and using decimals. Um, we're going to talk about round in the next tutorial, and then the following tutorial, we're going to talk about the decimal module and how to use that. But I just want you to be aware that this has nothing to do with the Python language. This is not a bug in the Python language. This actually has to do with the underlying C language. Now, if you go out and Google um, why are floating point numbers so inaccurate in computers, you will find some good information on this. And if you want to get really technical, then I suggest you do that. Um, but I don't want to get too de technical with uh, you know the average user here. Um, there's a lot of math involved. It's breaking down fractions and all these other equations going on and how it works. They'll explain to you how it works um, if you want to get that deep. But for now, just if you're following along on our tutorials, I just want you to know that it has nothing to do with Python. Python's not broken. There's no bugs in Python. It's just a way that the underlying C language handles floats and sends it back to Python. Now we can fix this issue and we're going to show you how to do that in the next two tutorials so make sure you subscribe uh, if you got any questions or comments leave them on YouTube or on our website at learnpythontutorial.com and we'll see you in the next one and we'll talk about round and how we can fix this issue